Hello everybody, Gamer Penny here bringing you another episode of our Coral Island Let's Play and we are back with Cole. Hey Mark. Yes, good morning, I'm Mark. You're the new farmer, I know. I'm here to give you some info. The cavern northwest of here is now open right through the forest. When you see Jack's ranch, go left and follow the path. It was closed? Yes, it was closed and now it's open. Catch any of that? The band of smiles cleared up the top levels of the cavern. It's safe to roam, no monsters anymore. Just don't go too deep, your garden rake won't help you there. Monsters. It is dangerous. That's all, if you want to know more, ask Kira. I'm done here. Bye Mark. Wasted time. Oh. Okay. All right, are these done? They are. Are these done? They are. Okay, then we got to water these. Okay. Do a quick Okay. Um J. Okay. Starting out, claim reward. Now we need to make a scarecrow. We'll do that, but I want to go get- I want to sell these and get more seeds. Hello. Hmm, yeah? Ah, the new resident. My ex told me about the grandchild of some farmer moving back in. That must be you. See you around. Bye, Antonio. Hello! Good kitty. Did you know I was just about to write a piece on the harms of oil drilling companies? And now one appeared right in our homes. Are you planting any melons on your farm? Oh right, melons are a summer crop, aren't they? Now that winter is over, it's time to wash all the blankets and put them in storage. My parents never explained why they named me Suki and my sister Alice. Your grandparents' farm was neglected for a long time. You should have seen it. It wasn't a pretty sight. Mayor Connor was going to turn it into a community garden before you moved in. Aw, oh, someone took our base. We need to find another place now. Opens at nine. Okay. Oh, we missed Joko's birthday. Someone on here we don't know. care about all these oil talk. I'll care when they can supply us with better weapons and amenities. Come on, nine o'clock. There we go. Shop. I would like to sell you some turnips. Daisies. I would like to buy... We did turnips and daisies. Let's buy... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 
eight, nine. Oh, dang. Nine of those. Nine of those. And then... Upgrade the bag. Yes. Okay. Alright, let's go plant these. Hello. I always wonder why Bree didn't buy your grandparents' land. Seems to be at the lookout all the time, so she clearly enjoys the view from up there. When I first took over Coral Inn, I was pretty clueless. It definitely involves a lot, but I imagine it's not quite as demanding as running a farm. Being alone isn't always bad. Personal space is rarely a thing when you grow up with someone sparkly like Suki. All right, let's go plant these. Oh, I should have given her the bouquet. All right, we'll run back and find her again. Okay. All right, next, 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 next. All right, we got our crops in. Um, let's go give this bouquet to someone. Alice still up here? Yep, she is. It's so cool, thank you. Second time we've run into that Rico Suave. That Miss Pufferfish doesn't seem to take no for an answer. Whatever, I'll be ready for the shenanigans. I'm trying to persuade my cousins to expand the inn's business. Maybe they could add karaoke, let people choose songs and sing along. They keep turning me down. Didn't see the potential, I guess. My cousins? Well, technically the twins who run the inn are my ex-cousins-in-law, but we treat them like family. Thought that was pretty standard, but maybe it's just an us thing. Finally getting warmer. Can't wait to get back outside. Do you sell here? Stop. Ah. A blunt sword. Okay, interesting. All the kids are up here at school. Of all my years living here, I never would have thought an oil company would ever move here. What should we do? I can't believe we have a corporate office across our house. It's a, a bit weird. I haven't seen many pufferfish, pufferfish employees around. They like to keep to themselves.
Okay, got that. Got a flower. Oh. Got another butterfly. I'm enjoying the view. I was foraging in the woodland earlier, and I think I gathered enough for dinner. My family have been freaking out about pufferfish all day. Honestly, I'm on the fence for this one. They invested a lot in our rocket projects. Maybe they'll do the same here. Emma doesn't seem to like the new office that much. Thought it would be good for business, but maybe not. I don't know. Another butterfly. Fly. A new farmer in town. You moved here after the oil spill? Huh. I'm Zara. See you around. I can't go this way. Festival use only. Ah. This? Oh, you can buy different outfits. <gasps> There's a chicken outfit? C D C A B C D <laughs> You can get wings. That's cool. Okay. I have to keep that in mind. Back here. Goff on me. Hello, puppers. Taco is busy. Can't talk right now. He's busy doing what? Those puffer fish people va va What? Those puffer fish people vibe are bad, Cole. Oh no, mate. Bad is not enough. It's evil. Go to the museum, drop off what we found. We got a reward. Potato seeds, eight of them. Uh oh. Maybe if we do this... Cool, come take a look at this. You see this? This is a blueprint for a bigger museum. The museum we have now is... It works, but can you imagine something bigger? Something more extravagant? Imagine this, Cole. We have one section dedicated to the aquatic creatures of this island. Then there's another section where we can look at all the fossils we've dug up. Oh, 
Oh, we can have a bigger and better section for the ancient artifacts. Doesn't that sound exciting? Sounds really cool. Isn't it? But there's one big problem, though. The town just doesn't have the budget to build this museum. At least not yet. So, what if we raise the money to build it? By that, I mean I'm gonna p start a Pickstarter campaign. Do you know what a Pickstarter is? I know what it is, I just don't know if you sh should run one? No, I don't know. Can, it, can you explain? Kickstarter is a crowdfunding platform. We put our project online, then people can help fund it. In return, we'll give them something from the project as a token of appreciation. Great idea, right? Anyway. I'm almost ready to launch this campaign, but there are a few things I need help with. Based on my research, the most successful campaigns are those that already have something significant to show. Something to reassure the backers that they're backing a legit project. If I show the empty museum in the campaign, people are going to think this project is a scam or something. Now, my dear hardworking Cole, this is where you come in. We're really happy with what you've brought to the museum so far. They're all amazing, but it's not enough. I asked Macy to take pictures of our museum yesterday and it just looked empty. No one is going to help us if all we show them is an empty museum. But if you were to donate more items, you see where I'm going with this? That's right, the museum won't look so empty and we can convince more people to help us fund our project. Now, while you help us gather more artifacts, I'm going to prepare other materials to upload to the campaign page. I'll scan this blueprint, then I'll ask Millie to write something awesome for the campaign. Or well, maybe I should get Lily to make us a website. Look at that, it's all coming together. Now go forth, Cole, collect more items so we can launch our Kickstarter campaign. Alright. 10 of 50! I need to go plant these potatoes. We'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And do, 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 do. Perfect. Then I can put in here these butterflies. I want to keep these. Okay. Put these in here. Okay. Um, let us clear some of this stuff out. Oops. All right, 
We've got a bunch of stuff there, so let's go... The quick transfer. This and this up there. Okay. Um, let me get this. Shells. Sell the shells. Okay, then we'll go to sleep. Makeshift Scarecrow, that's what I wanted. Oh, a relationship with Alice. 236. Okay, perfect. Um, if we can make the Scarecrow. I need 11 more trash. Just so happens. Okay, got trash up here. So that means we can do this. Do right there. Okay. Glass. All right, we need to water. Crops are all watered. Let's do a little bit of fishing in the pond here, huh? Tilapia. Crayfish. Another crayfish. Okay. So we'll give these to, um, actually, this one in there. 
We'll give these two to the museum. Uh-oh. Hey there, Cole. It's good to see you. I'm just heading to Raja's Coffee. Are you here to socialize? Yes, by the way, what's with the pufferfish scene? Ah, the scene, yeah. It's easier if I show you. Let's head to the community center and chat there. My coffee can wait. See that large F on the town rank board? Yes, that's us. It didn't happen suddenly, though. This room used to be the pride and joy of our town, proudly displaying Starlet Town's A rank. An A, Cole. Sometimes we got a B, but it was never an F until... I need to sit down to tell you what happened. Some time ago... That's correct, Mayor. As usual, every season we start by looking at why pe people visit Starlet Town. Visitors come here to see your museum, heritage sites, and ocean. The town rank we award is based on the condition of these attractions at the time of review. Today we're awarding Starlight Town with a rank of... F. Say what? <laughs> Hello. Listen, prepare all necessary documents and equipment. I found the perfect location. Last year, an oil spill from a neighboring island made its way here and wreaked havoc. Everything went downhill from there. Karen was there at the town rank hearing. They've been watching us this whole time, these conniving pufferfish people. You heard what she said the other day at the new Pufferfish building. Their plan to rescue us out is to rebrand Starlet Town as an oil town. Just the thought of abandoning our legacy, the museum, ocean, the heritage sites, it's hard to accept. On the other hand, thinking about our town going under is harder. Our town used to be good, Cole. Great, even. Business was booming. The town, it was lively. I'm afraid that unless we can increase the town rank back to A and regain the trust of visitors, we'll have no choice but to work with Pufferfish. Refilling the museum seems straightforward and achievable, it will just take time. But healing the sick heritage sites or getting rid of those stubborn roots in the ocean? Where do we even start? How do we even start? Our town is in a difficult position. It's a lot to take in, I know. How about you join me for the coffee? The walk in fresh air will do us both good. Uh oh, we're seeing something over here. Is everything all right? Showcases your overall progress in revitalizing the town. Raise the town's rank by improving the ocean, museum, and heritage. Okay. Hello, Rico. Or Antonio. Cole, I heard from everyone about the new oil company. Terrible, terrible news. If another spill, oil spill happens, I'll bring my family out of here. Planning to go to the Cherry Blossom Festival, Cole? You don't want to miss it. Dia is busy and can't talk. Paco is busy. <laughs> Alright. Well, I needed to go to the museum. That's what I was doing. We go.
Got him in there. How do we find artifacts and stuff? Look at him swimming. A crayfish. I'm pretty glad people aren't taken to the idea of oil drills around here. On the other hand, I get why some are fretting about the island withering away without any investments. Somehow I got to talk to him, but not the others. Almost had it. <laughs> Dang it. Hello. Peanut. You wonder what this cat is doing here, but you realize maybe that's just what cats do. Alright. What about the diving? Going fishing, Cole? Still closed, and I can't talk to her because it's closed. Alright, then we'll do some fishing. It's trash. A flyer. Okay, this isn't a, a trash or anything. Got it! Barracuda! Dang! I like this fishing game better than Stardew Valley's fishing game. The Stardew Valley I had to mod in a different um, thing, but I don't think we'll do that here. Lionfish. Oh, dang it. Oh, do we know you? Cole, did I say it right? I'm Waku. It's a pleasure to meet you. Dad told me about you. He's the one who brought you here on the chicken boat. Yep, the one with the hat. <laughs> did I hear a Pokyo accent? Oh, you are. Where in Pokyo are you from? Next to the thingy. Oh, right, the thingy. Yes, of course. Clean 
clean up some of this trash on the beach. Maybe that will help. Over here. We know you? I'm not sure where to stand on this pufferfish thing. Anyway, I hope they pay good tips when they're getting some coffee. Alright, let's go home. We got a few things. Hello, kitties. Oh, we got something else growing here. Go to the museum. Hello, beautiful. I think we already caught one of those, though. Barracuda, the lionfish. Got it. All right. Let's go to bed. And then tomorrow we might go check out that cavern. Okay, I would like to ship this and this. What's this? Scrap? The wasabis. Pine drinks. The fire. Okay. Go to bed. Level up catching. Three max stamina. New craftables. Ground insect scent. Forging, fishing, catching, other. Okay. Next day. Uh oh. Can you hear me, basically? You hear a voice, but can't make out what's being said. Oh. Try to focus on my voice. Good, now listen closely. The sacred trees, please visit any one of them. Find them around the island. Flashbang. Touch the tablet to summon them. They will open your eye. You are my hope to heal the island. Now wake up and go, Cole. Interesting. He had a strange dream last night. Inspect a tablet at the sacred tree. We can do that after we water all our crops.
Okay. So we were gonna go to the cavern, but I feel like we should go find one of those trees. Um... Person. Where is this sacred tree? I thought there was one down. Okay, maybe there's one up here. there was one down here. Oh, there's one right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go to that one. Dang it. I'm stuck. There we go. <laughs> There. Nice to see a familiar face. The cherry blossoms look beautiful this time of year. My hair gets sticky fast lately. Kinda hate it. Is that is yours that way too? The coffee maker at the shop is weather resistant. It can withstand rain, snow even. It's costly but worth every penny. Yeah, I need to go see the sacred tree. No. Got it, Lady Beetle. Don't understand what it says. Hello. Ah. <laughs> Where'd he go now? Make sure it was nothing more than that. You should investigate with sacred trees around. Inspect the tablet. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Emery. Where'd he go? Got another caterpillar. Offer. Bring it to the blacksmith to unlock. There may be valuable items inside. Alright. Let's go do that. I don't know where that guy went. Why'd he run away? Hello, kitties. We'll stop at the museum, drop off this bug. Look at the lionfish! Where's the barracuda? I think this is the river. The ocean stuff. Lionfish. Take 
Lady Beetle. Okay. On to the blacksmith. Hello, Taco. Most people usually get their flu vaccines in winter or spring. That's when you're most vulnerable. I get mine in fall to prepare for the coming season. Give it a try, see how it feels. Charles has to take his antihistamine. I don't know what else to tell him. It will literally make him feel better. I hope it starts raining soon. Alright, I want you to open this coffer of mine. Apparently closed. What times are they open? Playground, exciting. Blacksmith closed. Closed on Sunday. Is today Sunday? It must be. It is. It's Sunday. Dang it. Hello. Lara was using a metal detector down at the beach the other day and she found a gold coin. You're welcome to bathe at the hot spring. It's open to the public. You don't need to pay to enter. Really? Mushroom. Seeds. More seeds. Another tree. Get bug over here. Inventory full. Whoops. Um, let's get rid of the trash. The wasp. Okay, we can go back to the museum now. Caverns up that way, yes, I know. Hello. A farmer. Okay. I'm Kira. We'll have to go to the, f the cavern next time. Look at all the animals. Back to the museum. Get this wasp in there. Okay. All right.
right, then let's go home and put away some stuff. Maybe we'll make another bouquet. Sap and any flower. Craftable scent that lowers awareness of ground insects can be consumed or attached to a trap. Ooh. Okay. Can I make another chest? I need three more trash. We'll just deal with it. Alright, I think for now we'll go to bed. I did 185. And with that, we're gonna go ahead and end here. So guys... Uh oh. Something's happening. Okay, so with that, we're going to go ahead and end here. Guys, I want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Coral Island Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. All right, bye-bye, everyone.